So I wanted to do this as a supplemental video to the one that I had just unlocked for everybody about the halo and the bow, the rainbow that the first rider has. So understand that the bow is also known as and and translated as the simplest of fabrics now there are many people that are trying to understand this and i had forgotten that that people didn't understand what this meant so you're going to learn the truth of it here so the bow which is the simplest of fabrics that is mentioned of remember the bow is also the veil and how the veil would be lifted the bow is the fabric of society that holds everything together, that holds everything in its place. And see that that veil has been lifted. See that everything is coming apart. The fabric of society. Look it all up for yourselves now, people, and see just how accurate this is for yourselves. But more importantly, I want to make this, uh, I guess you would say, a correction. So I had said that the, he is the first and the last, the first and the last horseman. The last horseman is actually Gabriel. Gabriel, it's a known fact that Gabriel is a, the angel of death. But it's also known, and it, it states that death is on that horse, that last horse. But he is carrying the sword understand that he is what he brings with him is the sword of the lord and you need to understand the significance of gabriel he comes only as commanded with the full power of the lord understand that that's also why he was sent as the messenger to mary about uh, the birth of, of jesus christ Gabriel is significant because he also controls and uh, is the herald of the waters. And understand everything that I've taught about that. Look up your information about Gabriel and his significance. He is in the, the these days, he is the most beloved angel of the Lord. And realize that he was the one that went to Mary. So Gabriel has great significance and he comes at the command of the Lord and with his full power, with his sword. Understand that, but this is more important so I can help y'all understand so y'all don't have any confusion about what the bow means, what the simplest of fabrics actually means. And this has never been taught or revealed either. And you need to look it up for yourself so you understand just how accurate I'm, I'm, am in teaching this. It is the fabric of society. It is the veil that has been lifted. See how the fabric of society is being torn apart just like the veil at the temple upon Christ's crucifixion. It's being torn apart just like that veil in those days. Y'all be sure to research this and stay in the Word. God bless.